I should get an award for getting out for down three on that hand. That's what I think. So here's how this is going to go down. Um, I've, I've come up with an with a amusing list of rules that I think a lot of people kind of <laughs> follow or something. I'm not sure if this is like a comprehensive list. I know that there are a lot of funny things that people will say, such as one of the rules that I have is that two opening hands uh, make game. And so we're going to bid game if partner opens and we have an opening hand, no matter what our hand looks like. If we have like a bad 11 count, partner opens. It is a best hand tournament, in fact. We'll bid game. Um, if partner ever overcalls, we're going to lead their suit because you're supposed to lead their suit. Uh, we're always going to play second hand low or third hand high on defense. Um, we'll only be responding to partner's opening bids with six high card points. I mean, obviously in a best hand tournament, that one's not going to come up. I'm not sure what other sort of like meme rules people use or like beginning bridge players use. These were the ones that I kind of thought of, but I feel like hopefully this will generate some amusing situations. And so that's where we're going to go with. Pass, pass. Aside from that, we're just going to do whatever we want in general. I mean, this hand kind of looked to me like a no trump opener. We have 16, six card minor, singleton king. So let's do it in third seat. Partner transfers us to hearts. Wonderful. Oh, and passes us out. Oh my God, that is a big hand. Seven highs, an ace and a king. Obviously we're in third seat with our no trump opener. So kind of understandable. Well, we're only in two hearts. It's imps. Don't need to play for over tricks. I have the feeling that maybe roughing diamonds in my hand is going to be the best way to try and make this contract. I have a spade, a diamond, at least, I mean, probably two hearts to lose. I mean, I guess alternatively, I could pull a couple rounds of trumps and hope the club's split. Maybe that's not so bad. Mm. I don't know. Let's just win the club ace and lead a diamond to the, towards the king. West tries to cash the queen of diamonds. I think I want to try and knock out the spade ace now. Because they don't really have a profitable way to pull trumps and prevent my other diamond rough. So as long as trumps don't split terribly from here, I'm in good shape, right? If I play the queen of hearts and they win and they return a trump, I could win the king of hearts. And I guess at most from there, I would end up losing two heart tricks and a diamond trick, but I might be able to pitch my diamond on two more rounds of clubs. I think that's probably safest. <clears throat> Whoa. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. East forgot to open. And, um, second seat with a seven card diamond suit. Who would have thought? Oh, wow. Um, so hearts were 4-1. We could have done a little bit better if it was match points, but happy to be plus at imps. Board two, we have 17. We get to open a diamond, I guess. 
I'm sure there are players in the field who open this two now. Um, we'll open a diamond. Ooh, partner bids two clubs. Look at this. We better bid at least a game. Important. Because this might not necessarily be a hand with long clubs, I think partner would do this sometimes with like 3-3, three, 3-4 three, three, shape. Is that true? Maybe they always have to have at least five clubs. I actually don't know. Let's say partner had, so what are the no trump ranges? I know that a diamond two no trump is 11 to 12, which I think is hilarious. So a diamond three no is 13 to 15. So if partner had 16 highs, which I guess they can, we have 17. If partner had 16 highs with three, 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 four shape, what would they do? I think they have to bid two clubs. I'm also pretty sure three clubs would show four. Yeah, I, I don't know why this is, um, why three clubs would show four, but I guess we can rebid two diamonds and see what happens next. I, I just have the feeling they're gonna bid some number of no trump. Oh, they bid hearts. Okay, I am, let's support the club suit. Partner also has a singleton spade. Is anyone else concerned about this information? <laughs> I'm not, I'm no longer convinced partner's bidding is uh, sensible. It's not great news that partner has three diamonds because now the diamond queen's an important card and the fact that partner has a singleton spade means we can't take advantage of like king doubleton of spades, for example, to pitch a heart loser. Was the probability that robot's description is correct? I'm not sure. So I guess if partner doesn't have a spade stopper, they wouldn't be able to bid three now. So could partner have a hand that's like queen, doubleton, ace, fourth, small doubleton, ace, jack, ten, fifth, maybe? I, I, I imagine that's possible. You know, the fact that neither opponent has bid when they have 11 spades I don't think is so weird considering on the previous board he forgot to open three diamonds with the jack 10, 9, 8, 7. Um, but yeah, I think it's very possible that partner's just temporizing three diamonds because they don't have spades stopped. I guess what I want to do, because I want to bid a slam, like at least a slam. Uh, unclear, unclear if I want to slam. I mean, I think if partner really is one, four, three, five in shape, I'm less confident about bidding a slam than if they were like two, four, two, five. Because then at least I wouldn't need the diamond queen. I could just go ace, can, diamonds, diamond rough in a club contract, and my hand would be good. Let's, uh, so what is four now? Is this key card in diamonds? I kind of want a key card in clubs. Like we could still have zero diamond losers without the diamond queen, but we can't without the club queen. I mean, unless partner has like ace, queen, jack, fourth of hearts maybe, but that seems less likely. Wait, I have no way to play the sand in clubs anymore? Why would four clubs be a cubid? Oh, no, 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 no. Three hearts shows four hearts. Yeah, at this point in the auction, three hearts should definitely show four. Three spades shows four spades because that's a potential suit we could play in. Oh my God. Wait, is there nothing I can do? Four clubs is a cubid, four diamonds says nothing. Four hearts, oh, four hearts also shows four hearts. Um, 
Wait. <laughs> Hold on. Four heads shows hearts and four spades is a splinter. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay. Well. <clears throat> Like, I have a great hand if partner wanted to take over and bid key card. Maybe I should just let them do that. They don't know it about the sixth diamond, but... They can't have four of them. I don't think there's any way partner has four diamonds. Sure, why not? Let's splinter in spades. How could this go wrong? We'll show our three key cards. Partner confirms all the key cards and the queen of diamonds. Okay. That makes things interesting, right? It's imps. We don't need to worry about seven no trump. So are we good enough to just bid seven diamonds? What is partner's hand? I guess it doesn't hurt to bid six clubs for now, right? Partner should hopefully... I mean, I don't know why I thought partner would ever do anything other than um, bid six diamonds here. See, this is this is a place where I'm pretty sure partner six diamonds should deny the club queen. If they really had their, their bidding and we showed them the club king, they know about all the key cards and now the filling king of clubs to fit in with their ace queen fifth of clubs. I don't think partner has the queen of clubs. I, I mean... They shouldn't. <clears throat> Which I guess makes Grand pretty bad. Uh, okay. Look at this! Partner does have the stupid 2425 shape. What are they doing? <laughs> why why can't we play this hand in clubs? Also, they have the Queen of Clubs. Like, this is so horrible. Partner can count. Hold on, how many tricks can partner count? They don't know about the King of Hearts. Oh, I, I hate this so much. Partner has a normal one no opener. <laughs> That's true too. Partner also has a normal one no opener. <laughs> Wait, I opened though. I opened a diamond. Never mind. Never mind. It's not it's not on them. Well, at least that thing is not on them. Oh my god! <laughs> Completely saved. Look at that. They rough trick one. Hopefully this also gets roughed. I think that would be awesome. It did not. My god, so seven no trump was the contract end up in, it looks like. Oh, it wasn't, because jack fourth the diamonds. We were not picking that up. Wow. I do believe that's unfortunately going to be pretty close to average in this field. Um, most people don't even think about bidding grands, but... I mean, we obviously missed out on an excellent grand. I think seven clubs is probably the grand that we want to get to. Like, we can survive um, a 4-1 diamond split in the club suit. Like, technically we need to be worried about 4-1 clubs as well, but we can at least pick that up with West holding the club length. Yeah, seven clubs looks like the right place. I mean, that's where I wanted to go. I wanted to, <laughs> I wanted clubs to be trumps. That's okay. Board three. Ooh, look at this. We have an opening hand. Let's open a club. Partner bids two now, which is 11 to 12. And by definition, 11 to 12 is an opening hand, so we will bid game. Just gotta follow the rules. We get the ace of hearts lead. Of course we do. <laughs> Why did they lead the Ace of Hearts? Oh my. And a spade switch. <laughs> so now how many tricks do we have? Probably three hearts, three spades, a diamond is seven. 
we're gonna need to set up some club tricks. I suppose that means I want to win the spade queen and lead a club to the 10. I feel like hearts are probably 5-1. So if I win, if I block the spade suit and lead a heart to the nine, I'm not like too happy cashing the king of hearts. Also blocking the spade suit might kind of strand South's hand a little bit. All right, let's win the queen and lead a club. <laughs> okay, that's... <laughs> oh my God. What was that trick? <laughs> it could be Ace Queen Doubleton. Why did he sleep the Ace of Hearts? I guess it's gotta be ace queen doubleton. So the king of diamonds has to be on side. We only had 12. This is best hand. Oh, I'm so confused. <laughs> uh, queen of clubs. Second hand low robot, come on. You know this. Okay, okay, high cards that I have. Assuming the Diamond King's on side, I have two spades, two hearts, two diamonds, and one more club, which would be enough to make the contract. I mean, I guess it's possible that West has ducked the club ace here. That feels like a really weird play to make, though. All right, let's just play a heart to the nine. Okay. <laughs> sure. 11 tricks. <laughs> queen of clubs for ace queen third? I guess they were hoping their partner had jack fourth. All right, you know what? I have made that play before. Uh, I actually did it against Pepsi, I remember. Um, it was somewhat effective. <laughs> I mean, partner did have the jack when I made the play. Uh, so I was able to build an entry that way because it's it's kind of was the reason robot didn't lead a spade, dude. I don't know. I've I've given up on analyzing. There are no trump opening leads. It's just <laughs> I would have expected a spade lead too. <laughs> they really like leading aces because aces allow them to remain on lead and they might find a killer switch. Like if their partner had king fourth of clubs, for example, and they lead a spade. North-South might take the first nine tricks, whereas if they lead the Ace of Hearts, they could still switch to Ace of Clubs, Queen of Clubs next. They never would, but they don't understand that they're not going to do that. I mean, that's my explanation for why they led the Ace of Hearts, but <laughs> it's pretty dumb. A spade, a no trump. What do I have? Do I have 11? Barely. This is not a good hand. Let's just double the opponents no matter what they get to. Two no trump. I mean, this is getting past. West has an 11 count. Now we're, we're, oh my God, partner, partner. 
<laughs> this wasn't a takeout double. That's okay. Partner thinks it's a takeout double. It's fine. It's fine. We're in, <laughs> why are we in four diamonds? They were going to be in three spades. <laughs> this, this isn't good. Uh, <laughs> okay. Let's, um, should I crack to hearts? Sure. <laughs> Four hearts passes out? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> um, well, important question. Do I have any hopes of holding this to down one? <sighs> they have the ace of spades, a spade rough, the king of diamonds, the ace king of clubs, that's five tricks. I haven't even counted the Ace of Hearts yet. That's six. I have to deal with a bunch of other small spades in hand. West is going to get diamond roughs. Okay, more important question. Are they making four hearts against me <laughs> on this hand? We were just going to end up defending two no trump. And yet here we are in four hearts undoubled. Hmm. I mean, it looks like two no trump would not have gone very well for them. <sighs> Obviously, neither would three spades. Hmm. Let's, um, hey, shift. It's imps, it's imps, so like, it's totally fine. Going down extra vulnerable under tricks is not the worst thing to have happened. I feel like diamonds have to be 5-1. Otherwise, why did East double four diamonds and not four hearts? I'm also pretty sure that West is like... I guess West is like 6-2-1-4. That would make sense. All robot doubles are takeout. That's true, it does seem to be the case. This auction's wild a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. I guess I'm gonna try and pull trumps. So West has ace, queen of spades. Or let's think about east because east bid two now. East has the king of diamonds, one club honor, and nothing in spades. So East has the hard ace. West has the ace, queen of spades, a club honor. West must have the jack of hearts, so I guess it's doubleton jack. Otherwise, how could they possibly open with only 10 high card points? I mean, maybe West didn't lead from Ace King of Clubs. I guess that's also possible. I'm pretty sure I'm in trouble no matter what, but let's try and pin the Jack Doubleton apart. Okay, that was successful. I did not unblock the Heart Suit and Dummy. Looks like it might not matter. East is gonna get a Spade Rough. Ooh. So if I try and play spade to the king east roughs and sticks me back in hand with the nine of hearts, I have to lose two more spades at the end. But if I go ten of hearts heart, east gets n played into leading into dummy's jack nine of diamonds, and dummy has the rest. I wonder if they'll let me claim. They will not. Oh, be, because I, I haven't seen west show out on the ten of hearts. No! Wait, okay, hold on. I, I... <laughs> he saw the end play coming. How rude of them. 
Look at look at look at that devious East character trying to unblock that nine of hearts. I mean, it didn't matter. I can still cross to the king of spades. They get the ten of diamonds in the end. Wow, this was kind of a crazy hand. All in all, if only there was a way for us to not end up declaring this contract and instead we're able to double the opponents and whatever they ended up in. But I guess bridge is just a little bit too hard sometimes. <laughs> Minus 300, dude. I, I should get an award for getting out for down three on that hand. That's what I think. Board five, pass, pass. We have opened a club. Have I played every hand so far? I have a heart, double, two hearts. Well, I have a good hand. Kind of feels like a four spade bid. Um, I mean, I think West is unlikely to lead away from the Ace of Hearts, unfortunately. Otherwise, I would be more confident about this. Let's do it. Spade lead. Yeah, they don't lead a heart away from the ace. Maybe it's okay, though, that Queen of Clubs could represent a way to pitch our heart losers. Partner does not have a great hand. I mean, they, they have a pretty good hand given what we have, but overall, it's not ideal. Spade to the queen. All right, let's pull a trump. They've split. I mean, we could definitely pull another trump and just go ace of clubs club. We're only going to lose if he does king jack third. Seems pretty reasonable to me. No reason to not lead the clubs from North's hand, though. Great. Uh, I know the Ace of Hearts is off, so I will just give them a club and two hearts. West would always lead our heart if they didn't have the Ace here, I'm pretty sure. 620. 13 highs here. We will open a club. Michaels. Partner makes a penalty double. And we see two hearts. So this double passed by me should be forcing. <laughs> it, it should be forcing. I don't know if it's going to be. <laughs> like, <laughs> partner, <laughs> you can't. You can't do this and then pass them out at the two level. Oh no. All right, let's lead a high club. High club lead was ineffective. Nice queen of hearts part. Thank you. What, what is Declara doing? <laughs> Why did they play a diamond to the 10? <laughs> what weird play. Ah, good. They missed their slam, is what I'm hearing. <laughs> Partner! <laughs> what? How did this defense go so horribly wrong? They did miss a game, though. I don't know how I feel about that one. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> what should partner have done over two hearts? I mean, probably, well, two no would be like minors, or at least should be minors, since if they had a no trump bid, they would just double two hearts. Um, that seems reasonable. Three clubs seems reasonable. But I guess the opponents missed a cold game. 
I mean, how cold is the game? They have a diamond and a spade to lose. And even if trumps are 3 1, it's not completely cold. I mean, it's definitely worth bidding because on 2 2 trumps, it's. There's an easy 10 tricks. You just lose a diamond and two spades at most. But on 3 1 trumps, I guess you have some difficulty. Anyway. Minus 200, great result, partner. <laughs> Good thing your auction scared them off. I mean, East was definitely never bidding more than two hearts. Maybe West should have raised. What have we got here? 19, we'll open a club. Not this shit again. Three clubs, double. Mm. Let's just uh, blue card them and red card them. No, partner, please, <laughs> please. <laughs> this can't be how it ends. I guess I'm gonna try five clubs. I'm a little worried partner has three spades over there. Partner's like three, one, four, five in shape or something like that. I mean, I would say normally partner can't really path or pull this double. <clears throat> Even when robot doubles are penalty, they still don't set them. That's true. They do frequently run. I, I think it's just some sort of program thing in where unless their simulations almost always have the contract going down, they're averaging based on the total points scored on the deal because they don't understand like the match point perspective, right? Like from a match point stance, if we were to score a plus 200 against three hearts, we would get 100% of the match points. So that would be awesome. And if we're minus, you know, 730 or whatever, then we're going to get 0%. So technically all we need to do is beat three hearts 51% of the time to do better than the field. Um, but for the robots, because the difference in scores minus 730 versus plus 200, they need us to be like 80% sure about um, to beat three hearts for them to sit the double. <clears throat> I am 80% sure we're beating three hearts, but <laughs> partner might not be. Uh, hmm. I mean, it's imps, right? Like we probably have no losers outside of spades. I'm declaring though, so like if partner happens to have the spade king as part of their values, it's gonna go spade to the queen, ace of spades, spade rough, not good. There's no guarantee West leads a spade. They might lead a heart. All right, let's bid the game. I mean, maybe we should have just bid three now over three hearts and hope that that was making. Let's bid five clubs. We don't get a spade lead, so this is good. Partner has kind of exactly what I was expecting. Although, hmm, we have a little bit of difficulty here. Because while I've avoided two rounds of spades and a third round roughed, I still have to rough a diamond in my hand before pulling trumps. I might even need to rough two diamonds in my hand. Let's see what happens to trick one. East does not cover the eight of diamonds. That might be okay though. It might mean that West has led from uh, 10 third and East has queen empty fourth. So where are my, where are my chances in this contract? Um, Can I rough three hearts in North's hand? Ooh. No, that's probably not good enough, is it? 
even if I'm able to pull that off, they'll be able to knock out my Ace King of Diamonds before I set up the spades. So I guess one option is I could play for 3-3 three, three spades. Like before pulling trumps, I can knock out the Ace King of Spades, try and score my long spade trick, or my third round of spades. Hmm. Yeah, the hand's a little bit complicated, isn't it? If I go ace, king of diamonds, two rounds of clubs, ending in dummy, lead the jack of diamonds, let's say it gets covered and rough, I go ace of hearts, heart rough, pull the last trump. I mean, I just get tapped out way too quickly. I think I have to go after the spade suit before... before pulling trumps. So they're gonna get a spade rough, but there's just nothing I can do about it. I mean, east could be three, four, four, two in shape. That's possible. Okay. Wow, East just returns a diamond. What a champ. So if spades are splitting, am I making this now? I go Ace of Hearts, Heart Rough, Spade towards the Jack. East wins, even if they switch to clubs at this point, I think I just have a high cross rough. I guess we'll try it because I don't really see the alternative plan. Uh, West is high load in spades. Oh! <gasps> I think we did it! We can now rough a heart low, rough a diamond. Well, we can just claim. Yeah, we do just have a high cross rough from here. Why did West high low in spades? I have no idea. Hmm. Five clubs making. So it was three no making. We have eight top tricks. Unclear. <laughs> Unclear if three no was making. <laughs> I mean, it shouldn't make. West can just lead a heart. They set up three hearts in the ace king of spades, but who knows? One diamond by east. We have a pretty good hand. Wait, did I violate any of the rules on board six? Oh no. I was on lead. Oh, I was on lead twice. Partner never bid and partner never made a lead. Okay. Whew. I'm still following all of my rules. This is very important. I guess we start with the takeout double. Partner is a passed hand, bids one spade. I mean, it is a free bid, but partner had stronger ways to bid spades. I guess I will bid two spades. I like how they think two spades is 12 to 18 points. Support double by East. Four diamonds. <laughs> uh, excuse me? Well, let me think about this for a second. East has four diamonds, right? Because East only has three hearts, and the only way they could have Ooh, it even says four plus diamonds now. Normally, they could have a three card suit if they were four, four, three, two. So West is like six, four, or so they're claiming. The opponents have 10 diamonds between them.
I don't think I want to double this. It might go down. Like I think I'm pretty sure at match points I would double, but at imps, it feels like we might just score the ace king of hearts and the club ace. It's possible. Is there any chance we make four spades? We have a heart loser, we have a diamond loser. East has the king of clubs. We have no club loser. I think there's a chance we make four spades. I I don't really understand why partner's not bidding it though. They're the one with the singleton diamond. It's because they think that we have like 11 high card points. Maybe that's why. I'm gonna try it. Partner partner just has the nuts over there. They have like ace fourth of trumps and can't. Is this really just a one spade bid? Maybe. Maybe it's a little too weak to bid two spades directly, but king of diamonds lead. Eight of hearts switch. <laughs> Try double, partner will take it out. That's a good thought. Maybe I should have done that. Um, so yeah, how do we do this? Spade to the ace, spade. If he follows low, I I mean, obviously, if spades are 3 2, we don't have a problem. We just go spade to the ace spade. East has to have the spade king, which is marked from the opening bid. <clears throat> I could rough a diamond and lead a low spade. If he follows low, I can win the queen and cross to the spade ace. And if he's turned up with king jack fourth, then what? I think I'm just down. I, I hmm. <laughs> uh, okay. Wait, what if I go spade to the ace, spade to the 10? No, 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 that's no good. That'll be bad if West has um, Jack Doubleton, because they set up a heart trick, and then East gets in with the spade king, and they cash a heart. OK. So what can I do about 4-1 spades? Because I'm pretty sure spades are 4-1. Not guaranteed, but I think it seems pretty likely that East shape is 4-3, 4-2. Spade to the ace, spade to the ten. I don't actually think I can make it if that's a sand. Oh, you know what? If I rough a diamond and lead a low spade, if East plays low, I can win the 10, and then rather than doing anything else, I can play on clubs. No, this does, This also doesn't work. I don't. I really don't think there's anything I can do about 4-1 spades. I think I'm just down. Yuck. Well, 
Wait. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Hold on. I see, I see an idea. I don't know if it's a good idea. What if I have a ton of entries to North Sand? Like, let's say West has the Jack of Clubs. If I lead a club to the 10 and I lead a low spade, If East ever plays the King of Spades, I can actually pull trumps and run the club suit. So East can never afford to um, give me trump control. So they play low, I win the 10. I play the Queen of Clubs over to the King as both opponents follow. I lead another low spade. Again, East can't afford to play the king, so they have to play low again. So I've now won two more spades, so this time I play a spade to like the queen or nine, it doesn't matter. West shows out, but now I can start running clubs, and I still have the ace of spades as an entry to North's hand to pull the last trump. So whenever East roughs in, I will be able to pull the last trump and then run clubs pitching my hard loser. I guess I make 11 tricks that way. So the important piece of the puzzle here is to not use the Ace of Spades as an entry. Um, so does this work if I rough the Jack of Diamonds? Jack of Diamonds rough, low spade, East plays low, I win the 10, I cross to the King of Clubs and lead another low spade. If East ducks again, I continue running clubs. Yeah, so that's covered. If East wins the King of Spades at this point, though, and continues hearts, I win. I unblock the Spade Ace. I play a club to the Ace. I pull the last trump. I run clubs. Maybe, maybe I'm just... Okay, so maybe I can make it if East has King Jack fourth of Spades. I just need to be very careful. Diamond rough, let me, let me think this through again. This line of play is confusing to me. Diamond rough, low spade, east. If they play the king of spades and they return a heart, it's easy. I go king of hearts, spade to the ace, spade finesse, I pull trumps, clubs run. If they play the king of spades and they return a diamond, I can just pitch a heart rough in hand, eventually lose two spade tricks and the one diamond I've lost, but I no longer have a heart loser. So again, easy. Um, so they duck. I win the Ten of Spades. I now cross to the King of Clubs. So I don't do any of this weird finesse the Ten of Clubs playing West for the Jack. Uh, lead another low spade. So North is now down to single to Ace of Spades. Again, if he's plays King of Spades, it's easy. And if they duck, I win the queen, start playing on clubs, they rough in. Yeah, okay, I think we're actually good here. Okay, good start. Now they play a diamond, this is okay. I can pitch my heart loser, I have no issue. Um, with the over tricks. I mean, like, at, at match points, I guess I would have um, maybe thought a little bit harder about this plan, trying to make 11 tricks, but 420. Whew! <laughs> Close one. Uh, well, back-to-back -back game boards. That was nice. Pass, pass. Let's open a club. Partner bids a no trump. Well played again, thank you. Club a no trump. I mean, okay. I <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. I'm still like trying to get over last hand. Was that more compl did I make it more complicated than it actually was? I don't think I did. I don't know. 
Queen of Hearts lead. We're in a no trump. I have like zero tricks. How is this possible? I have 13 and partner has 10. I've got four top tricks. I can set up a spade trick. Excellent. I guess I'm gonna use my dummy entries to take diamond hooks. That looks like the most reasonable start. Queen of hearts lead. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hold on. No, 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 no. No, you, you go first. West, you tell me what this jack is fade switch is all about. I just, I want to give you an opportunity to explain. Like, <laughs> oh, I, I guess the south hand is face up. North is the one declaring. But still, like, there's the king of hearts won that trick. And the king of spades is sitting here in dummy. Are hearts really 6-2? Is that what's going on? That would be very disappointing. Jack of spades switch? What the hell? Hearts were 6 2! <laughs> Amazing! I'm not convinced I thought this hand through fully. I need to find a discard now. It's okay, it's a part score, right? Like, this just, this hand doesn't matter as much as the previous two boards. If I go down on the part score, it's okay. Jack of spades switch, oh my god. Uh, I'm going to pitch a... D hey, ATN, I'm already down. Oh, have I miscounted? They have five hearts, the ace of spades, oh, and the jack of diamonds. All right, thank you. That was, <laughs> I have miscounted. You're so right. All right, all right, all right, all right. Good enough. Down one, good call. Was there anything I could have done? I mean, I could have played on spades, right? Like I could have played west for jack third of spades instead of taking a diamond finesse. That seems kind of crazy to me. I guess I could have ducked the first round of hearts, but wouldn't have been effective. He still has the ace. Ace of spades entry. Minus 50. Three boards to go. Pass by east. We have 16. We'll open a no trump. Two spades. Spades and a minor. Partner bids Labensol. I will follow the rules. Partner signs off in three hearts. Great. Partner just has a balanced seven count. Cool, with five hearts. <laughs> the robots really need to learn to play negative doubles. Negative doubles would be ideal in these types of scenarios. Do we have a chance in game? Probably not. Two diamonds lead could easily be a singleton. I think it's very likely to be a singleton given that West definitely has the ace king of spades or should have the ace-king of spades. So I think West has diamonds and spades. Does look like I can pitch a club loser on the fourth round of diamonds, though. So let's play the ace. King of hearts. Ooh, hearts have split. That's good news. Oh, hearts have really split. What? Why would you lead a diamond away from the king? Oh my god, also, nice club switch. Wow. That's kind of a crazy play. We score a beer, though, and we make the contract. <laughs> what is this diamond, Lee? He's just like, you know what? I got a spade fit with partner. We got some safe leads. I mean, I could lead a club, which is a little less uh, 
likely to give up a trick than a diamond, given that my club spots are slightly weaker, or my clubs are a little bit weaker than my diamonds. Nope, diamond it is. That has to be partner's suit, I'm convinced. <laughs> wow. It worked. It did work. I mean, it kind of worked. It didn't work well enough. Uh, I guess they would have beaten four, four hearts if we got there. How do we do in four hearts? We have two spades and a club to lose for sure. Like, technically, you can pick up the diamond suit. I guess you probably would, given that West has clubs. <laughs> what a weird lead, the two of diamonds. 140, we'll take it. Uh, 13 here, let's open a club. Partner bids art, we'll bid a spade. Partner bids three spades which is 10 to 12 total points. While partner might have a hand that could have opened, I think we have to bid game. We do have some nice fitting heart honors as well. Heart lead, ah yes. <laughs> of course the heart lead makes sense. We have a lot of losers. I don't really have a convenient way to lead a spade to the queen. I guess I'm gonna just lead a spade to the 10, maybe? Okay. Well, that's, oh my god. What? <laughs> I never know if I'm supposed to unblock these like honors when they just randomly cash aces. I don't think it's gonna cost me here, but wow, what is West doing? So West has the ace of spades, the ace of diamonds. I guess they have the king of clubs as well. What? <laughs> uh, okay. Ace, jack, third of spades, well done. They just fly the ace of spades. I mean, I was gonna pick it up, so I guess it didn't really matter. They switched to ace of diamonds. They never put a club through. Wait, why would they never put a club through? They didn't even have the club king. What? What? How could they ever think it was a good idea to cash the diamond ace there? Wow, okay, we'll, we'll take 450. I approve. East opens a club. East false carded. Ah yeah, East false carded with the 10 from 10-9 Doubleton. I have the feeling that the robots don't understand that principle because I've seen them do it before. I think East was trying to give count, but I'm not sure. All right, last for it. East opens a club. We have 14. I think I'm good. A spade and no drum. So we can double for takeout here, <laughs> not penalty. Oh my God. Hmm, I don't have a very good opening lead. <laughs> I think I might lead the queen of diamonds. Am I doubling this? My spade spots aren't great. I mean, the two of spades specifically. I'm, I mean, why not? Why not? <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Well, that one I also double is takeout. I'm sorry. Hold on. Hold on just a second. I mean, I'm going to make this bid, but 
Just so you know, partner thinks this double is takeout. To be clear. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> that was amazing. Hey, it looks like the Queen of Diamonds might have actually been a good opening lead against three now. Possibly. Well, what do I do? Trick one. I probably duck this. Because if I don't, I can't effectively continue pulling trumps. Um, I mean, I could have partners nine of spades is from nine eight doubleton. I could go king of spades, low spade. That's a little suspect though. Let's just duck. Nine of hearts is not good news for us. Because our queen of hearts is going to rough out now. Nine of diamonds. I mean, normally I would just cover this. Trying to figure out how bad it can be if I duck. I should cover. Partner plays the 10, of course they do. They just exit to me so that I can cash out. <laughs> uh, okay, thank you. So this was really helpful. Thanks, guys. <laughs> 500. We'll take it. Also, partner false carded in hearts. Way to go. King of hearts plays the nine on the first round of the suit. That felt like a pretty good last board. I don't know how some of these results are. I mean, board 10, I think people will be in four hearts and probably make it. Board four, who knows what's going to happen. I violated the rule. Did I? Oh no, what did I do? Wait, which rule? <laughs> we are plus 21 on the day. How did we lose five and a half on board six? The opponents missed a cold game, vulnerable, and we lost five and a half imps? How is that possible? What? I guess if people like a bid with my hand over two hearts, we just get, we're allowed to play in three of a minor or something. Oh, second hand high. Oh my God. Oh, you're so right. I forgot. I didn't mean to, oh, I'm sorry. I was thinking about it, but I completely, Ignored it. You're totally right. I violated the rule of second hand um, low. Second hand low, third hand high. I'll try and remember. We do still have one more set to play. <laughs> but just, how is this minus five and a half? Wow. That's kind of crazy. Board four, no surprise, minus three and a half. Oh, look at board two. It is completely flat across 37 tables. How strange. I mean, seven clubs being a very nice contract. Seven diamonds also a pretty nice contract, as is seven no trump. And yet, no imp swung. Thank you for the luck, ATN. Have a good evening. Take care. We did pick up... So we, we picked up 10 on the last board. That was the the big win of the set, four spades. How bad was three now gonna be on the queen of diamonds lead? They just don't have very many tricks. They have like two hearts, two spades, two clubs and a diamond. I guess they're like down two. I mean, it's probably better than four spades doubled down three, but 
still would have been kind of a disaster. The two games we made were pretty nice. A couple of the other games that we made were pretty good. Board three? Three no trump making however many tricks, 11 tricks was good. Board five, four spades making 10 tricks was also good. 